trick shot winner about midway through today's session. All right, so as you know, it's session 28. We're kicking off week 10 here. Week 10, which is really, really hard to believe. All right, some of you guys have been here for every single session. Some of you, it's your first one. Either way, we're gonna get in some great work this week and we're gonna continue to get better. All right, so for today, eight different skills, a minute to learn each skill, 30 seconds in two rounds, one round of 30 seconds, next round of 30 seconds, two rounds where you're gonna be asked to keep your score. Every time you get a score from one of those rounds, put it into the live feed and then put it into the Google Sheet. We're asking that the best of the two scores is going into the live feed and into the Google Sheet. All right, so compete for 30 seconds, catch your breath, compete again, whatever the higher of the two numbers was, into the live feed, into the Google Sheet, Keep all, positive, uh, all comments positive in that feed, please. Don't worry about someone else's score. If you know them, great, you guys can compare. But if it's a stranger, let them be. You're there so I can see your scores and see how everybody in the feed is doing, all right? Let's go ahead and get ourselves warmed up and get ourselves ready to go. We're gonna keep it very, very simple. We're gonna use some different ball manipulation and then when I shout go, you're looking to get off in any direction that you like. So to get ourselves started, let's just go toe taps. And when you hear go, you're just gonna dribble one or two steps any direction you like. So toe taps, you hear go, dribble any way you like, one or two steps. Ready and start. So just toe taps as you're in place, get your arms moving, legs moving, go. Take one or two touches and get yourself back to the start. Toe taps, ready, go. Here's the only rule. You can't go in the same direction twice. So I've gone forward, I've gone left. I have to go somewhere else. Go. You can go back, you can go out on an angle. It's up to you. Toe taps, ready. Go. Get yourself back, toe taps. Go. All right, and hold. Now, you're going to box the ball where you are. When you hear go, you have to roll twice in any direction. All right, and when I say roll, with the bottom of your foot, across your body, two times. Any direction you like. Ready? And start. Boxing the ball. When you hear go, roll the ball twice in any direction. Go! Get yourself reset. Box the ball. Ready? Go! Get yourself reset. Box the ball. Remember, roll it twice in any direction. Go! Get yourself reset. Go. And hold there. This time, you're going to pull push where you are. Pull push, pull push, bottom to the laces. When you hear go, you have to push the ball with the bottom of your foot forward three times. Not just four, you can go anyway. So I can go forward, sideways, and go back. But I'm going to move the ball with the sole of my foot three times. All right, ready? Pull, push. When you hear go, move the ball with the sole of your foot three times. Ready, and go. And get yourself back. Pull, push. Woof. Ready, go. Get yourself back. Pull, push. Go. And reset. Pull, push, ready, go. And get on back to the start. Now, while we're waiting, we're gonna slide down the ball all in the same spot. Slide, 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 slide. When you hear go, you're going to pull Cruyff, take off in any direction, one or two steps. All right, so sliding the ball, slide, slide, slide. You hear go. You're going to pull Cruyff any direction. Ready? Go! Get off one or two steps. Get yourself back. Ready? Go! Get yourself back. Slide down the ball. Go! Get yourself reset. Slide down the ball. One more, one more. Slide. Go. And hold there. All right. Go ahead, grab a sip, 
Get your ball and let's go and get the session rolling. Woo. Get your sip and we're gonna get going with our first skill. Oh, did not stretch today. We're in trouble, Stim. We're in trouble. All right, so for first one, we're gonna do a drag push and then stop the ball still, all right? So drag push, inside, outside, stop it still. In, out, sit the ball still. Big toe, little toe, stop at the bottom. Big toe, little toe, stop at the bottom. In, out, stop. In, out, stop. So you're trying to go right foot, left foot. In, out, stop. In, out, stop. In, out, stop. Right to left. Across, push, stop. Across, push, stop. In, out, stop. Big toe, little toe, bottom. Inside, outside, sole. Inside, outside, sole. Two, three. Three touches before switching feet. Inside, outside, stop. Inside, outside, stop. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Back and forth, all right. If you don't have a hang of it, look up here. My right foot's on the ball, my left foot is hopping. So when I move the ball to my left, I'm gonna hop towards my left. Then I'm gonna move it to my right. I'm gonna hop towards my right, and I'll stop it still. So I hop to the side, hop to the side, stop it still. Hop, hop, stop it still. In, out, stop. Inside with the hop, outside with the hop, stop it still. In, hop, out, hop, stop it still. If you can't get the hop down, go inside, step, step, outside, step, step, stop. Inside, step, step, outside, step, step, stop. If you need the steps, take them, all right? Let's go ahead and keep score, 30 seconds. Every time you stop it, you get a point. So it's in, out, second point. In, out, third point. Every time you stop, you get one point. Ready, set. Go! One, two, make sure you have got a low center of gravity, meaning your knees are bent, you're putting your body, scrunching it towards the ground, and you're looking to keep the foot that's dribbling outside the frame of your body a little bit, or just under that shoulder, and the other foot, same thing, just outside the frame of the body, or under that shoulder. Don't let your feet get too close. Three, Two, one, time. All right, good round, good round. We're gonna go again. Every time I stop, I get a point, okay? If you can't get that hop going, inside step, outside step, stop. Inside step, outside step, stop. If you can't get the hop, that's what you're looking to do. We wanna use the hop because it's gonna be a little more fluid, okay? It's gonna allow us to move more quickly and efficiently. Here we go, 30 seconds, keeping your score again. Every stop's a point. Go, one, try to drag before you push, in before it goes out. Move the ball six inches to a foot with every touch other than the stop touch. And in the outside touch, the ball should move about a foot of distance. All your touches, whoo, go side to side. Nothing's forward. Nothing's back. Five, four, three, two, one. Time. Nice round, my friends. Nice round. That's one down. One down. Let's go ahead and get a sip. Get themselves reset. Stimma, what do I do for knee pain? What do I do, bud? Is it the hard surface? Is it me? Am I putting on too much weight? Tell me. All right, with our next one. Same idea, still that drag push, but before we go into out, we're gonna shuffle the ball three times. So we're gonna go one, two, three, inside, outside. One, two, three, drag push. One, two, three, drag push. One, two, three, drag push. One, two, three, in, out. One, two, three, inside, outside. One, two, three, in, out. One, two, three, drag push. One, two, three. Drag, push, one, two, three, in, out. One, two, three, in, out. If you've got it, get rolling. If not, watch here. So the one, two, three, just shuffling the ball. 
We're just going inside, inside, inside. Okay? After the third inside touch, okay? One, two, three. Third inside touch. Sit the ball kind of still with that one. And you're going to attack it with the opposite foot to go drag, push. All right? That same foot starts your shuffles. One, two, three. Don't bang the ball too hard on that last, that third touch. Sit it kind of still, maybe just under the center of your body, and then attack it with the other foot to drag and push. All right? So it's three touches, drag, push. Three touches, drag, push. Three touches, inside, outside. Three touches, in, out. Three touches, big toe, little toe. Three touches, big toe, little toe. All right? After your three inside touches, big toe, little toe. Three inside touches, big toe, little toe. Again, if we can keep them in the air, great. If we need to go inside step, outside step, that's fine too. All right, here we go. 30 seconds, keeping your score. Every drag push is one point. Ready, set, go. In, out, that's one. In, out, that's two. Try to hop on that opposite foot. Try not to have to take those extra steps if you can afford to. You can keep your balance and keep control and you don't need the steps, then do it. 10 more seconds. Again, pick your head up as often as you can. Glance around the field. Three, two, one. Time. All right, that's 30 seconds. Next round of 30 is about to start. After I'm done my shuffles, can I go inside hop, outside hop? One, two, three. Inside hop, outside hop. One, two, three. If I can keep that foot in the air, I'm going to allow it to move the ball a lot more quickly. Here we go. 30 seconds. Ready, set. Every drag flick is a point. Go. In, out. In, out. You shouldn't be moving too, too far from where you started. All of your movements are pretty much where you've been this entire time, right in the middle of your area. Hop for the inside and outside touch. 10 more seconds. This should resemble a Matthews movement that a lot of you already know. Five, four, three, two, one, time. Nice round, nice round, that's two in the books. Remember, better of the two scores, put into the feed, put into your sheet, please. Whew, grab another sip. Here we go. Next one. Slide box, drag push. Okay. With this next one, similar idea, but we're going to mix a slide into our shuffles. Okay? So instead of just one, two, three, one of those touches is going to be a slide. Make it the first one to slide. So slide, one, two, drag, push. Slide, one, two, drag, push. Slide, one, two, inside, outside. Slide, in, in, inside, outside. Slide, box, drag, push, slide, box, drag, push, slide, box, drag, push, slide, box, drag, push. All right, if you've got it, get rolling. If not, work with me here. One foot on top of the ball, okay? We're gonna slide down that ball. So my knee and my foot go to the outside of the ball to move it to the other foot. Start on the top, roll down the outside to move it to the other foot. My right foot goes out to the right of the ball to move it to the left foot. Right foot goes to the right of the ball to move it to the left. Two boxes, drag, push like you've done. Slide, one, two, drag, push. Slide, one, two, drag, push. Slide, one, two, drag, push. All right, so the slide is all we're adding. Slide, two inside touches, same drag, push that you've done. Slide, two inside touches, same drag, push that you've done. And again, if you can't drag, push in the air, go inside step, Outside step, slide. One, two, inside step, outside step. Slide, one, two, inside step, outside step. If you need the steps, take them. If not, keep it in the air. Here we go, 30 seconds, keeping your score. Every drag pushes a point. Set, uh-oh. Go. One, two, drag, push, that's one. One, two, 25 more seconds. You're five in, you should already have two or three down. 15 more seconds, my friends. The same foot you drag push with, 
that's also the one that does the slide. Again, you're not going too far away from where you started. Five seconds, four, three, two, one, time. That's 30 down, nice work, nice work. Sip if you need it, know what your score was. Top that score here. Here we go, 30 seconds, trying to top that score. Ready, slide, one, two, drag, push. All right, ready, set, go. Drag, push, that's a point. Drag, push, I'm staying in the center of my training area this whole time. Woo, in, out. Okay, I've got a hop for the in, hop for the outside touch. Okay, try to keep your body weight low to the ground. Woo, five more seconds. In and out, quickly between those two touches. Three, two, one, and time. Nice round, my friends. Very nice. That's three in the books. Very nice stuff. Three in the books. We've got one more until half. At half, we're going to announce last week's winners. Here we go. Okay. You guys can do this one. All right? Might sound like a lot. It's really not. To start, you're going to drag push. So to start, you're going to go inside, outside, and you're going to stop it, skip through. Other foot. In, out, stop, skip through. Other foot. In, out, stop, skip. Return it to the other foot. In, out, stop, skip, reset the ball. In, out, stop, skip, reset the ball. In, out, stop, skip, reset the ball. So it's right foot, in, out, stop, skip, left foot, in, out, stop, skip. Right foot, in, out, stop, skip, left foot, in, out, stop, skip. All right, I've shown you the first level where we can go inside step, outside step, step, before you stop and skip. The next level we'd like to get to, keep your foot in the air for your drag, push, and stop, skip through. Drag, push, stop, skip through. Drag, push, stop, skip through. If we can keep that foot in the air the whole time, even better. Drag, push, stop, and skip. Drag, push, stop, and skip. In, out, bottom, skip through. In, out, bottom, skip through. All right, let's go ahead and remember when we skip, I'm gonna skip with my left foot, my right foot is going to return it, okay? After I've skipped through, one foot skips through, the other returns it to reset the ball. So in, out, stop, skip, return it. In, out, stop, skip, return. In, out, stop, skip, reset the ball. In, out, stop, skip, reset the ball. That reset is going to allow you to get to the next rep a lot more quickly. If you can't, chase the ball down, get it reset on your own. Here we go, 30 seconds. Every stop, skip is one point. Ready? Inside, outside, stop, skip. Inside, outside, stop, skip. Ready? Set? Go! One. Every time you stop, skip, give yourself a point. In, out, stop, skip. In, out, stop, skip. Every time you stop, skip, you get one point. 15 more seconds. 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and time. Good round, good round, good round. One more chance to beat that score. Here we go. One more chance to beat it. Remember, inside, outside, straight to the top of the ball if you can. Skip through, okay? In, out, straight to the top. Skip through. When you go in, out, keep that foot on that side of the body by hopping. Don't go across. That's how you're going to lose your balance here. We got to end up that way. Here we go. 30 seconds. Every stop skip is a point. Inside, outside, stop, skip. Ready, set, go. One, two, three. In, out, stop, and skip. In, out, stop, skip. Right foot keeps the ball on the right. Left foot keeps it on the left. Well, we have 10 more seconds, 10 more seconds, 
five, four, three, two, one, time. Halfway through, my friends. Halfway through, give yourself a pat. Give bro a pat, sis a pat. All right, give yourself a sit. Very, very nice work. Very nice, okay. We are gonna now announce our two prize pack winners. One from the Friday training session, and one from last week's Trick Shot Challenge, all right? So, I'll just grab a magnet, so you know. This is for the two t-shirts, the magnet, and the juggling bands. All right, so our first Corver champ, our first winner from the Trick Shot Challenge, Trick Shot Challenge, was Megan, I believe from Maryland. Megan, she did a rainbow over top of a tree limb, took it out of the air, one or two juggles, volleyed into a basket. Kudos to Meg. This was one of the hardest ones to choose from. There are a lot of really, really, really good entries. A lot of really good entries. Had to go with Meg in the end. I thought difficulty of the rainbow, finding the basket out of the air was pretty impressive. So congrats to Megan. Uh, our other winner for Friday's training session, Friday's training session prize pack winner was Sophia with an F from Langhorn, PA. So Langhorn, Pennsylvania, Sophia, you are our winner from Friday's training session. So if you're Sophia from Langhorn or Megan, uh, please send us a DM, send uh, us an email, get in touch with us after the session, tell your folks, get, get in touch with us, and we just need your shipping address, okay? So wherever we can mail you your prize pack, send that to us, okay? So wherever your uh, snail mail address is, Send that to us, and we will get your prize pack out this afternoon if we get it early, tomorrow morning at worst, okay? So send us your address, and we can get that to you ASAP. Um, other thing, what else? If you haven't reviewed us, please go ahead and review our page uh, as soon as possible. Again, if we get over 150 reviews on Facebook, we're going to give away that jacket and shorts at our last session. So if you haven't reviewed, please go and do so. Um, I think that's about it. Let's get into our second half. Don't forget to wear blue on Wednesday. Here we go, second half of our session. We're gonna drag across, so instead of just a drag and hop, all right, we're gonna drag totally up the ball and we're gonna keep our feet kind of standing still. So I'm gonna drag across my body, that was that fake pass that we've done before, pull it back in, sit it still at the inside of that same foot. Drag across, pull it back, sit it still. Across, pull it back, sit it still. Drag across, pull back, sit the ball still. Drag across, pull back, sit the ball still. When I drag across, I'm gonna look that way. It looks like I'm gonna pass, but I just roll up to the top of the ball, fake it, bring it back to me. Fake that pass, bring it back to me. Across, back to me. Across, back to me. So I drag, pull. Drag across, pull. Drag across, pull. Inside of the foot until the bottom reaches the top, bring it back. Inside of the foot until the bottom reaches the top, bring it back. My foot stays attached to the ball, the whole way up, all right? So I start with the inside and my foot rolls and attaches to the ball the entire time. My foot never leaves the ball when I'm doing that drag. So I drag all the way up the ball, pull it back to me. Drag all the way up, pull it back to me. Drag across, pull back. Drag across, pull back. Drag across, pull back. So you should hopefully be able to get a little bit of a rhythm, left foot, then the right foot. Left foot, then the right foot, okay? If you're not feeling totally comfortable, Drag to about here, your knee can stay bent. If you're feeling confident, drag all the way out until your knee straightens out. So I can do a little one, or I can do a big fake. You find what you can get away with while still keeping control of the ball. Better fake will be here, okay? But this is fine, all right? So find out where you are. Does my knee have to stay bent, or can I extend it? All right, here we go. 30 seconds, keeping your score. Every fake pass is one point. Alternate feet as often as possible. It should be every time, but again, you can't quite get it. No worries, do what you can. 30 seconds, keeping your score. Ready? Every drag across and pull back is one point. Every fake pass is one point. Set, go. One, and you may make a mistake here. Okay, I feel like I might make a mistake here. No big deal, this is kind of a risky touch. We're pushing the ball away from our body to the last second, we're pulling it back into us. So drag across, fake pass, pull it back. Across, fake pass, pull it back. Right foot to left foot. 10 more seconds, pick your head up as often as you can, especially in the direction of where you're passing. That's gonna help sell that fake a little bit more. 
three, two, one, time. Nice round. That's good. That's one in the books. Know what your score was. Every time you fake pass, you get one point. Know what your score was and beat it here. If you had 20, you're going for 25. Here we go. Ready, set, go. Start with the inside of the foot and stay attached to the ball until the bottom of your foot reaches the top of the ball. You're going to fake across your body, right face left, left foot face to the right. Remember, it can be a small fake or a large one. Okay? Keep your knee bent or straighten your knee out based on your level. Five, four, three, two, one, time. That's good. That's five down. That's five skills down. Better your two scores. Put in the feed, put in the sheet, please. Here we go. Skill number six. Okay. Same idea as the last one. But instead of me facing you the whole time, I'm going to drag across and actually do a 180 spin so my back is to the camera by the time I do that drag and pull. So I'm going to do a full turn. So instead of me facing you the whole time, I'm going to turn and put my back to you. So I go across, back to you, and then pull. Okay? Inside, inside. Across, pull, and I'm back to you. Inside, inside. Across. Okay, I'm half pulled, I'm off to the side. Pull and turn, inside, inside. Across, pull and turn, one, two. Across, pull and turn, one, two. Across, pull and turn, one, two. So when I turn, two inside touches, okay? When I get turned, two inside touches. After the second inside touch, I drag across, turn and pull. One, two, drag across, turn and pull, one, two, Drag across, turn and pull. One, two, across, pull. One, two, across, pull. One, two, across, pull. One, two, across, pull. All right? So there's something out on my side here. I keep turning towards that way. I'm going to keep going this way. I'm never turning that way. So that way I can use my right foot, my left foot. My right foot, my left foot. Doesn't matter which way you start with, but stay on one side the whole time or the other side the whole time. Drag across, turn, and pull. One, two. Drag across, turn, and pull. So go from the camera to the back the other way. All right, hopefully I've explained that decently. Let's go ahead and get rolling. Every time you turn, is a point. That's one, two, three, four. Okay, that's how we're going to score this. It's a 180 spin, 180 spin. Okay, 30 seconds, keeping your score. Every turn is one point. Ready? Set, go. One, two, turn. One, two, drag and turn. One, two, drag, turn. One, two, drag, turn. One, two, drag, turn. One, two, drag, turn. One, two, fake pass, pull it back. Two, fake pass, pull it back. Two, fake pass, pull it back. Ten more seconds. Drag across, pull it back. Drag across, pull it back. Drag across, pull it back. Two touches and across. Two touches and across. Three, two, one, time. That's 30 seconds. That's the first round. Second round coming up. When I drag across, reach the top of the ball, then I'm going to pull into my body and spin the other way. One, two, reach the top of the ball, pull to my body, and spin the other way. All right? 30 seconds. Every turn's a point. Ready? Set. Go. Drag and pull. One, two. Drag across, pull back. One, two, drag across, pull back. Drag across, pull back. Right foot does it, left foot does it. Okay, you're alternating feet. Right foot, left foot. Stay attached to the ball for the drag and the pull. Should not be two touches, it should be one looping touch. Five more seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Time. <clears throat> nice round. Nice round, that is six in the books. Six in the books. Almost fell over again. Almost fell over again. Turf came up. <clears throat> Nothing new here. Comedy of errors. All right, here we go. So number seven, drag, pull, turn, inside, slide. Here we go. Everything's based off that turn with the drag, okay? If it's way too much, you can go one, step, step, and then pull. 
We can go inside step and then pull, but we want to complete that turn if we can. All right, you can't do one full touch. Go inside and then pull. All right, so drag, pull, turn, inside slide. Here we go. Drag, pull, turn, inside touch, slide. Drag, pull, inside, slide. Drag, pull, inside, slide. Drag, pull, inside, slide. So very much the same thing, but when I've completed my pull, my first touch is an inside touch, my second touch is a slide, then I'm gonna drag across, pull. First touch inside, second touch slide. Drag, pull, inside, 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 slide, okay? My inside touch moves it to my other foot. My slide pretty much keeps it still because I'm gonna attack the ball to get my drag motion, okay? Again, if you can't get that full drag and pull all in one, okay? Feel free to go inside, start turning, pull to complete your turn. One, two, inside, then a pull, okay? If you need to take those steps in between, go ahead and take them, all right? But after you've spun around, it's an inside touch, a slide touch, drag. Inside touch, slide touch, drag. Inside, slide, drag across, pull back. Inside, slide, drag across, pull back. With every pull, it's accompanied by a spin. Goes with a spin here to there, to you, to away. Here we go. Every turn is one point. Ready, set, inside, slide, drag and pull. Go! One. Two, inside slide, drag and pull. Inside slide, drag, pull. Inside slide, drag, pull. In slide, drag and pull. In slide, drag, pull. Inside slide, drag and pull. One, two, and across. One, two, and across. 10 more seconds. Try to make that drag touch, all one touch. Extend that foot as far as you can while keeping control. Time. Bit of a surprise there. Sorry, didn't give you a countdown. That was 30 seconds. Know the score. If you spun 10 times, you're looking to spin 15 this time. You can do it. Okay, if you can't spin on one touch, just go inside touch, step, pull touch. Inside touch, step, pull touch. Okay, if you can't do that one fluid motion. All right, go back and try it though. Here we go. Inside, slide, drag, pull. Inside, slide, drag, pull and pull. Here we go. 30 seconds. Ready, set, go. One. Every pull is your point. If you can extend that fake pass, that drag, okay, go ahead and extend it. Extend that leg. Lock that knee in a straight position. If it's too much, keep that knee bent and make it a tighter, shorter drag across so you can still keep control. Five, four, three, two, one, time. Nice round, nice round. That is seven in the books, my friends. Seven down, one to go for today's session. Session 28, after today, two more sessions, Wednesday and Friday. Here we go. Last one, I'm gonna drag, pull across. When the ball gets across, okay, it's gonna be inside, Step over, scissor. Drag, pull and turn. Inside, step over, scissor. Drag, pull. Inside, step over, scissor. Drag, pull. Inside, step over, scissor. Drag, pull. Inside to sit it still. Step over, scissor with the other foot. Drag across, pull it back. Inside to sit the ball still. Step over, scissor. Drag across. Pull it back. Inside to sit the ball still. Step over, scissor. All right? If my right foot drags, my right foot pulls, left foot stops it, right foot step over, scissor. Left foot drags, left foot pulls, right foot stops it, left foot step over, scissor. So whichever foot drags and pulls also does your step over, scissor. The left foot drags and pulls, the left foot does the step over, scissor. So it's a cross, spin, Step over, scissor. Across, spin, step over, scissor. 
cross my body, complete my turn, step over, scissor. Cross my body, complete my turn, step over, scissor. Remember, you step over, scissor, tight to the turf as you can. You're not up here, okay? Inside of the foot fake, outside of the foot fake. All right, here we go. 30 seconds. Every time I complete my turn and do my step over scissor, I get one point. Complete my turn, step over scissor, I get another point. 30 seconds, keeping score. Step over scissor for a point. Set, go. One. Two. Keeping your score, we're keeping your score. Whoa. Pull, step over scissor. Across, pull, step over scissor. Across. Knew it was going to happen. I was like, man, I haven't made a mistake yet. Ten more seconds. Inside fake. Outside fake. That's your step over scissor. Woo! Running out of space. Step over scissor. Three, two, one. Time. All right, my friends. One more chance. One more chance. If you had five that time, you're going for ten this time. Okay? Try to increase your score by five every time. Go across, pull to you, step over scissor, okay? I ran into some issues that time because when I brought it and pulled, my inside touch was sloppy, meaning I'm chasing with my step over scissor. I don't wanna to have to chase, I wanna be able to keep it tight to my body. So when that inside touch happens, ball sits still, I have space around the front of it to use my double move. Sit the ball still, step over scissor. Drag across, pull, sit it still, step over scissor. Across, pull, Sit the ball still, step over, scissor. All right, here we go. Every time you pull and turn is a point, last chance. Beat your score by five. 30 seconds, go. Pull, one, pull, two, across, pull, step over, scissor. Across, pull, step over, scissor. Cross and pull, step over, scissor. Cross and pull, step over, scissor. We have got... Ten more seconds, me amigos. Let's go. Get two more. Get two more. Five, four, three, two, one. Time. Excellent, excellent, excellent session. That's 28 sessions in the books. Again, we'll see you on Wednesday for session 29 and on Friday for session 30. More giveaways. These are your final two chances to train with us live this spring. Two more chances to train live. Invite your friends. Please review us on our Facebook page if you haven't yet. Congrats to Megan. Congrats to Sophia. We'll announce today's Ball Mastery winner at the next session. We're blue on Wednesday to honor all of our healthcare workers. Keep practicing your social distancing. Keep washing your hands. Keep staying safe so don't get another peak. Let's keep this thing on the downward trajectory. Keep doing your part. And as always, if you're looking for more training opportunities, go to our YouTube page. Okay, You can find all these sessions or, or and or, go to CorverTrainer.com, and this week, tomorrow, we'll be putting up our sixth session that you can do. So we have five sessions that are totally new, you haven't seen here, and then we'll do number six on uh, mañana, all right? Bye, my friends. Thank goodness, no te technical difficulties. I still can't speak, but nothing new there. All right, thank you. Peace.